Inflated head. Come on, Jim. Let's take care of it. Whatever that means. What? Is that who I think it is? That's evil. That was evil's head. But yep, this is the level he stars in in this game. It does not do him justice. I'm afraid. He, uh, apparently, during the summer, he takes over for his brother. Uh, this is the Carnival of Scars, I believe. And, yeah, he help runs it. And he's a bastard, because you have to get to the top of the level, basically, and he tries to pop your head. I'm not sure how it explodes and you survive, but, uh, I guess that's why it takes off a lot of health. And there was a sandwich here, so let's go down and get it. And ammo and earthworm sign. Cool beans. We still got six lives, so that's good. The next level is going to whoop my ass. It's going to be quite... It might be amusing for you guys, but... Uh, I'm not sure about me. So we got 200 health, and it's probably going to take us all of it to get through this level, because I'm really bad at uh, avoiding these... Uh, Okay, wrong button. Avoiding these uh, light bulbs. I think it takes 10 health per... Is he not coming out? Okay. There he is. He was toying with me. He was teasing me. Ooh, avoided that one. It's not a very long level. I'm... There's a lot more levels like this than I remember. The first game, almost every single level was, you know, the 2D... Shoot him, uh, kind of. Oh, cool, got the health. Not like we need it. Two, the shooter kind of levels, and we've only had two of those so far. And we're on the seventh level, I think, or sixth? Sixth level. And, I don't know, I, I'm a little disappointed, because at this point in time, I would say the first game is definitely better. But, uh, I don't know, maybe the last few levels will, you know remedy that line of thought. Who knows? Alright, got another continue. I think we're near... The, yeah, we're near the end, though. There's a last stretch. But I'm gonna show you what happens now. And, yeah. If he lands on you, you lose 40 health. Yeah, 40. <laughs> it's okay, there's more health up there. So it's not a huge deal if you get hit, but... No, I'm not going to get hit again. You just have to uh, move right as he gets to the top of the screen, because that's the point at which he's going to come down. Ah. Kind of got to move fast, so I'd rather get hit by light bulbs than evil. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll take the hit. I think that was all three. Maybe not. I think I missed the uh, earth one, actually. Or did, no, that was at the bottom, wasn't it? I don't even know anymore. Alright, go away, evil. You're in my way. Whoa. We haven't had a platform in a while, and if you fall there, you fall a very, very long way. And that's it. But there's a second part, so don't worry. There we go. You hit the thing, it falls down. There should be other things that uh, come down. That was a terrible, terrible shot. You have to jump up with enough force to hit it. If you kind of just do a half jump, and then the thing doesn't hit the glove. And then you kind of just waste it. That was early. Okay, there it is. So there is something else. Let's see if we can hit the red one. Is it... Oh. Of course I... We're gonna get it. We're gonna get something. Is it... This next one, I think. No, this... Where is it? Alright. Now, I think that opens up the next... Didn't need that. Or that. Should be ammo. There's the ammo. Okay, three more. Screw it. Let's just... Empty it out. Ooh, a health. Or a life. Nice. I think that's the best you can actually do. So go me. And that's level. 
Well done. Well done indeed. See you guys on the next episode of Earthworm Jim 2.